Okay. So calculate the equilibrium concentration of ammonia if you've got 8.0 times 10 to the negative 2 molar nitrogen uh, at equilibrium, 5.0 times 10 to the negative 3rd hydrogen at equilibrium, and the equilibrium constant is what we figured out in the last problem, 0.059. Okay. So all you really have to do is uh, solve for ammonia here. Okay. So you're going to get all of this stuff on that side. Okay. So in order to do that, you want to isolate the variable of ammonia, right? So you're going to multiply by N2, right? Multiply by H2 cubed. What? Yeah. Multiply by H2 cubed, right? So N2 H2 cubed. And that's going to cancel there. And it's going to come over to this side, right? So now we're going to have concentration of N2 times the concentration of H2 cubed times K equals concentration of NH3 squared. Right? In order to get that square out of there, you got to take the square root of both sides. And when you do that, that cancels out. Okay? Right. So. Yeah. So this is the expression you're going to use. So, concentration of NH3 is going to equal the square root of the concentration of N2, which is 8.0 times 10 to the negative 2 times H2, 5.0 times 10 negative 3 cubed times k, which is 0 0.59. Okay. And then all you got to do is solve for that expression. So the equilibrium concentration for ammonia that I got was 7.7 .7 times 10 to the negative fifth mole. So if you didn't do that, you probably did something wrong on your calculator.